Good morning students. Welcome to the computer class. Today we will continue the same topic that is HTML. In previous video we have discussed about HTML tag, head tag, title tag, body tag, background color, font tag, margins, marquee and heading levels. And today's objectives are paragraph tag, HR tag, break, ordered list and unordered list. For using these tags, we have to firstly open notepad. As we have already done in previous video that how to open notepad. Like here I am clicking on the search box type notepad press the enter key now double click on this notepad application notepad window is open in front of you maximize it start typing your work as we have done some tags that helps to start the HTML coding. HTML second tag is head then title. Now give the title of your web page like I am writing students. Close the title tag Now close the head tag. Next we have started in previous video after head tag that is body tag. And in body tag we have given BG color also means background color. Now give the background color like here I am giving pink color. Now we have also learnt margins use that margins also here I am using only two margins now next tag is font tag for the appearance of the text You have to give different color in font color as we have given pink color in background. So here we will change the color like I am taking red. Now face. Here I am giving. As I told you, you can see from the format tab if you don't know the font face and you can copy from the that dialog box. That how can you use the font face. Here I am taking this one. Control C. And paste it here by pressing Control V. Now close the bracket. Now new tag which I am going to start is paragraph tag. This tag is used to display a paragraph on the web page. Its syntax is P tag with the brackets and you can write the paragraph here for two, three or four lines according to your need and close the paragraph tag with the forward slash. Now let's see it practically. Now start writing P tag. And here you have to write one paragraph of two or three lines. Students, here I have written one paragraph. And after writing the paragraph, I am going to close the paragraph tag. You can close in the same line or in new line. Now, 
let's see the output of this paragraph tag first of all we have to save this work by clicking on the file tab save option write down the name of your web page in whichever name you want to give like i'm going to give students live dot html according to the text here i have given the name now save it on desktop here i am clicking on the desktop option now click on save button minimize your work and find your web page name from your desktop like it is visible here now double click on this google chrome icon see students the output is displayed on your screen the paragraph that i have written in notepad that is as it is displaying on the screen now next thing if you want to break your paragraph means you want to see the lines in every different new line so we will use br tag br tag means break tag this tag splits the line and displays the text on a new line and its syntax is br with angular bracket and this tag does not require an end tag now see how we can use this br tag in paragraph tag you have to write the br tag after completing the one line of the paragraph like i am clicking after this full stop click here and start writing br with angular bracket this line is split now click here also and write down br br is written now save it again by clicking on the file tab save option minimize it open the web browser if you have already opened then refresh your work by clicking on this refresh button or reload this page button just click here see with the help of br tag the lines are break into different parts let's suppose here we have written three lines in paragraph and these three lines are divided into three different parts so next tag which i'm going to use is hr tag hr tag stands for horizontal rule and used to display a horizontal line across the web page its syntax is hr students this tag is simply draws a line on your web page let's suppose you want to divide your page into two parts like on one page i have done paragraph and on second page i want to do any different work so for that partition i will use hr tag now see how can we use again open notepad write down hr here now just write the hr tag this is also an empty tag and there is no need to close this tag now save it by clicking on file save minimize it our web page is already open refresh it see you can see a line this is drawn on your web page it it has divided your page into two parts and after this you can do your new work students for the better visibility of the hr you can give color to it by writing in between the brackets give space after hr word and write down color give any different color and close the double quotes now save it you can use the shortcut key also control plus s for saving your work now minimize it refresh your work you can see the hr is displayed in a blue color now next tag that i'm going to use is ol ol is a type of list 
means ordered list it is used to display the list of items in specific order its syntax is angular brackets with ol ol is a short form of ordered list word now write down your things and close the ol tag this list gives a number to each item in list that is why it is also known as the numbered list next list is unordered list this list is used when the items are not to be displayed in any particular order its syntax is ul with angular brackets and closing tag of ul with forward slash also students with these two list ordered and unordered list one thing is required that is li tag li tag means list item it displays the listed item in an ordered and unordered list its syntax is li li syntax it is optional to use the closing tag in li now let's see the work of ordered list and unordered list with the help of li tag first of all i am going to start ordered list here i am going to write some things about a character students this line i have not written in li tag because this i don't want to see in any order this is just a simple line in the form of paragraph and now i want to display the items in list here i have started the li tag li with the angular bracket integrity next and selfishness next is understanding you can see the output side by side while writing on a notepad now save this work again file save and see the output in web browser refresh it here you can see the listed items are displayed on your screen character is a combination of student this line i have not given any listed item that's why it is without any bullet or number these three words i have given in li tag that's why they are displayed in one particular order like 1 2 3 this is an order list that display your work in a particular order next thing which i'm going to do is unordered list before starting unordered list you have to close order list so that it does not give any effect to the other tag now here i have closed the order list now next list i'm going to start is ul ul means unordered list same thing i'm going to do here you have to just change the name of the tag rest of the things are same like you have to use li with the words that you want to display in a listed form so i'm copying these things here students you can change any word or anything according to the requirement of the web page i have just copied the same data here so that you can easily identify that which is ordered list and which is unordered list you can write anything according to the need now close the ul tag again here you can close in the same line or in the separate line there is no problem regarding this such work and student this is not a case sensitive language case sensitive means difference between a small letters in capital letter so you can write in any letter tags that we are writing in notepad like in capital or in small there will be no difference in between these things now save your work display it in output screen 
refresh your work now here you can see the same thing that i have written in notepad but i have used the different tags here i have used order list and here an order list order list display the things in particular order and an order list just show the bullets so students after completing your work you have to close the html tag here first of all close the phone tag now body tag and at the end you have to close html tag now again save your work and after completing your work you can close the notepad close it from here this close button so students today we have discussed about paragraph tag hr tag break tag order list and unordered list do the practice of these tags and previous tags that we have discussed in previous videos by making a website so that you can better understand the topic thank you